noise. That was the banjo selection for tonight. <clears throat> Let's play a couple different things. Hey, from the land of Chicago. Thanks, you guys, for being here. That's really sweet of you all to tune in. Let's get this uh, this thing going. Um, thanks a lot, y'all, for tuning in there on the YouTube. Week after week, we're here, come rain or shine. Doing a better job than my mailman here in East Nashville. I'll tell you what, those guys, you never know when they're going to come. I think I just put all the mail together and bring it once a week.
That's funny. I had this dream last night about <clears throat> Billy Strings. Uh, if anybody you know him, he's a famous bluegrass picker. Really, really talented guy. I don't know. I don't know him personally. And I met him one time in an event that I barely remember, and he does not remember at all. Uh, so why would I dream about him? I don't really know. But in this dream, I was playing a, a concert <clears throat> inside, and, and uh, it was like a in a room shaped like the Exit Inn in Nashville. If any of you know that room, it had a big pole in the center of it, a big square room, a lot of hard surfaces, and not too many people. Thanks a lot, Dream. Couldn't you just pad that pad the numbers a little bit there, subconscious? And uh, in any case, I announced that I was going to play. Uh, the one like I could see Billy Strings sitting there in the control room. Somehow there was a control room in this, which means like he was behind glass and he was like looking at me with his arms folded, like let's see what you got. And um, so I said I was going to play a bluegrass song, and I heard I said that in my dream. I was like, why would you say that? You shouldn't. Of all the things you should do, don't play bluegrass in front of this guy. He can do it better than anybody in the world. And I said, but I'm going to play the one. I'm going to play the one bluegrass song I know, which is Billy Gray. And uh, it's not a bluegrass song at all, but it's written by a guy, Norman Blake, who sometimes dabbles in the bluegrass music. So that was the best I could do. <clears throat> Man, I feel like I should play that song. That was weird. I, I kind of tricked myself into doing something here. <clears throat> Let me cue up the the old wordage. I think I, I think I might remember it, but... You know, I remembered it in my dream, at least. And I remember like playing, I got halfway, like halfway through in my dream. I don't think that it was probably like a dream montage. I don't know how that works. I don't think they usually go to full length, you know, full length songs in the dreams. I think they edit it for TV. And anyway, uh, but I looked over and Billy Strings was nodding. I was, he was like, yeah, that's a good one. And I was like, sweet. What does it all mean, guys? I don't know either. Billy Gray lyrics. Such a great song. Written by Norman Blake. Did I say that already? <clears throat> Although, on Google, it's credited to Robert Earl King, also an amazing songwriter, but he did not write this song. Google. Billy Gray brought in. Let's turn it down just a little bit. It's one of the great outlaw ballads here. Billy Gray rode into Gantry back in 83. There he didn't meet young Sarah McRae. The wild rose of morning, that pale flower dawning. The herald of springtime in his young life that day. Sarah, she could not see the daylight of reality. In her young eyes, Billy bore not a flaw. Knowing not her chosen one, he was a hired gun. Wanted back in Kansas City by the law. Then one day a tall man came riding over the Badlands Lying to the north of New Mexico He was overheard to say That he was looking for Bill Gray A ruthless man and a dangerous outlaw Deadly news came creeping to Billy fast asleep there in the Clarendon bar and hotel. Well, he 
fled toward the old church there on the outskirts just thinking that he'd climb up to the old steeple bed but a rifle ball came flying face down he lay dying there in the dust of the road where he fell Sarah, she ran to him, cursing that lawman, accepting no reason, knowing that he was killed. Sarah, she still lives in that same white framed house where she first met Billy some 40 years ago. And that wild rose of morning, she's faded with the dawning of every day of sorrow that these long years have sown. Written on the stone where the dusty winds have long blown, eighteen words to a passing world say the true love knows no season, no rhyme, and no reason, and justice is as cold as the Granger County clay. True love knows no season, no rhyme, and no reason. And justice is as cold as the Granger County clay. That's for Billy Strings right there. Billy Strings, the man in my dreams. Okay, that's getting a little weird. Thanks a lot, you guys, for tuning in. I'm so glad you're here. <laughs> uh, you're welcome, Tim. Thanks for uh, your patience there, my dude. And uh, part two coming shortly um, on the YouTubes there. Oh, you guys. Uh, on the YouTubes there, my buddy Tim commented that uh, he received a record that I had signed. And I was saying thanks. Because uh, he's been waiting for a minute, and <clears throat> I have the a new record coming out. Of course, there it is. It's called the Man Man in the Maroon. It comes out May twenty one to much fanfare, and uh, there'll be CDs and vinyl available available. And you can check that out on the uh, the old website. Uh, look me up in the phone book. I'm the only Corby with a K. Uh, and you can order that thing, and I'll send it to you right personal. Should we play one from the new song? Should we play one from the new record? Let's see how this one goes. I'm still, I'm still kind of learning it, even though I've played it about 50 times. That's how it goes these times. Oh, let's squeeze that out of the frame there. Let's make a more aesthetic experience for the YouTube people. Okay. Very nice. Hey, thanks y'all for tuning in there. This is a this is a song about <clears throat> this is a song about a a nice man who uh, about halfway through life suddenly found everything turned upside down. He'd all but given up on himself, and then uh, in waltz to woman, that's gonna happen sometimes. It's about a guy now. The song is uh, gonna be on the new record. It's called Soft as a Cactus, and the lovely and talented Aaron Ray sings harmonies on the record. So here we go. Soft as a cactus, hard as a Rubik's cube. I 
I was out of practice, didn't seem to matter to you. Like a house plant facing away from the window, you turn me around. I got a good feeling for once in my life. Soft as a cactus, hard as a Rubik's cube. I found a couple badges. Think I'll try and fix the two. Well, it's a pretty nice day to get out the bikes. We could ride through the neighborhood. I got a good feeling. Got a good a feeling. I got a good a feeling. Da 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 da. Uh -huh. I got a good a feeling. wants me to play the lottery song so i'm gonna play that honey baby i don't know if you're gonna be able to hear it on um on instagram because it's going to come through the headphones but it might be kind of otherwise it might be kind of acapella but you can always watch it on the youtube there um there's so many technological things that were that were going on okay so i'm gonna slide over here we're gonna hit it over camera one camera two Put that there, guys. Let's see how this works. Check, check, check. Yeah. 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 
Could I put a little song in your car? A little something to cheer you It's just a mighty hard road to hold You sing a song with a shaky voice And those pretty people say you seem nice to hear are all the same to every song I sing A hundred ways to say I don't know anything But I got a winning ticket for the Tri-State Lottery And I'm going down to Nashville Think I'll start me a bar chord band Get into something I can understand It's just a one, four, five I can't think of nothing better to do See the right song or sniffing glue It don't make much sense But I paid my rent again And my profit my scientists, they fight like hell Oh, come, oh, come, oh, come, oh, come Emmanuel But I got a winning ticket For the Tri-State Lottery And I'm going down to Nashville, Tennessee can't share my blanket sometimes But then I gotta sleep alone Those tumbleweeds don't have no home They just blow and blow and blow But I got a winning ticket For the Tri-State Lottery Nashville, Tennessee Let's try, let's try cheers. I've been, uh, a lot of people commented on the old cheers song lately, so maybe we'll try that one. And uh, thank you guys for tuning in. Let's play a couple more songs here. Making your way in the world today takes everything you've got. Taking a break from all your worries sure would help a lot. Wouldn't you like to get away? Sometimes you want to go where everybody knows your name. But don't. And they're always glad you came. You want to be where you can see. People are Troubles are all the same, yeah. You wanna go with everybody. 
play uh let's play this one um thanks you guys for tuning in and uh man i've been going through it today been feeling a lot of weird feelings today i know you guys can relate to those weird feelings yeah I queued up the guitar to play this song here and we'll see how this goes I played this one in Idaho a few weeks back. First church of Nazarene, just an orange brick box on 6th Street. With some plain old folks who like to sing Amazing Grace. I sitting in the pew, just a little kid, singing aloud because I said my dad did. Don't recall what the preacher said, those songs they stayed. You give me them cedars, 11 now, just an old guitar and a gospel song. It's alright if it's so wrong You don't got a singing tune Yeah and No one on your radio Ever came from Idaho But here come Nashville on the phone Asking where you've been No, not really <laughs> Well, I head out west with my bluegrass band what I understand with a Martin Box and my best friend And those songs from back when You give me them cedars of Lebanon Just an old guitar and gospel song It's alright if it's so wrong You don't gotta sing in tune It all started there With the woman at the piano The playing by ear And an old hymn book you didn't need The songs you didn't have to learn to sing You just opened up your mouth and they were there A hundred hallelujahs in the air Lover, lover, tell me twice Do you think that I sing nice? Are my vices worth a price Of pretty music? Well, say I'm right and say I'm wrong But I found my own shortcut to Zion Making wine from dandelions And I'll share some with you Hey, give me that Cedars of Lebanon, just an old guitar and a gospel song. It's alright if it's so wrong, you don't gotta sing in tune. Yeah, give me them cedars of Lebanon, just a late night and a guitar song. It's alright if it's so wrong, you don't gotta sing in
think we're going to call it on that. Guys, thanks a lot for tuning in. And uh, we'll be back here next week. Uh, different set, different songs. I'm uh, in the market for a baritone ukulele. I, I borrowed my <clears throat> borrowed this ukulele. I'm in the market for a baritone ukulele. I borrowed this uh, ukulele from a buddy of mine for about two years, and he finally asked for it back. That was annoying. Um, so I got to get another one of those things because I got a song on the new record um, that I did called Moon River. I arranged it for baritone uke and uh, toy keyboard. Uh, and, man, you know, I got an, I need an instrument to play that song. Uh, let's see. One other thing is uh, we'll be back here next Wednesday. And then uh, we're, I'm going to do a special Sunday morning show uh, on my birthday, uh, Sunday morning. I think my birthday is technically Monday, but I'm going to be surfing. So uh, I'll not be available for mass communications that day. But Sunday uh, morning, Sunday late morning, we're going to do a show and um, give it a little shout out, uh, put it on the Facebook, and um, hopefully some of my friends in Europe can see it. I've been trying to work that into the set for a long time. So that'll be kind of the, the little kickoff CD release show for uh, Man in the Maroon, which comes out May 21st. If you'd like to uh, go ahead and pre-order that mofo, uh, I think the link is in the comments. And... Um, if you'd like one of these trucker hats, these book nerd trucker hats, that's on the website. <clears throat> See, I'm a walking advertisement these days. You got to you got to do this yourself, kids. It's no, you can't count on anyone anymore. I did get a new shirt though today. Do you like it? Um, let me know in the comments. <laughs> All right, thanks so much for tuning in, guys. We'll see you next week. All right. Hey, thank you guys for tuning in. It's really sweet of you. Thanks for hanging in there with me. Yeah, and um, I really enjoyed playing this music this week, so thanks for being a part of it. All right. Please excuse me. I am now going to go for my evening run. Hey, Elizabeth. Um, oh, it's so good to see you. The Sylvestris. You guys are a great family. I love you. The kids, the the adults. Uh, amazing. Yeah. I got on Instagram, Diego. I don't know. It's a real conversation starter there. Uh, <clears throat> okay. We're going to do that. You can try to earn money next time you go live. Whoa. Instagram's trying to talk me into turning this into a living. Maybe someday Instagram. We'll see. Um, all right. Everybody, you have a good night. We'll see you next week. <laughs>